Route 206 rivals clash on the hardwood, and while the Tennessee Lady Vols just beat Rutgers in that thriller, another recent victim of Cat Summit's team stopped by Princeton to take on the Lady Tigers. I'm Mark Fontes with Sports. A year ago, Hun Lady Raider basketball crushed their counterparts from the Lawrenceville School by 37 points. So, during the offseason, the Big Red coaches took a long, hard look at their team's weaknesses. They then went out and did some recruiting. They picked up Shore Conference standout Megan Riley and a former CVC charm some of you may recognize. The Big Red, who won't be home again until January 7th, wanted to beat their Route 206 rival to Hun Raiders Tuesday. Big Red and White, that's Megan Riley, number one, dishing it to Jackie Klotz. Klotz to Julia Bretz, and that's a deuce. Bretz netted eight points on the night. Raiders and Asia Burnett covered by Riley. Burnett taking it into the paint. Dishing it back to Carrie Million, who puts up a million-dollar shot. It's worth only two, though. She then calls timeout. The Big Reds lead at this point seven. Klotz, who just transferred to Elville this year from West Windsor, Plainsboro North, already making a big impression with the Big Red. She pulls in this Riley pass and banks a nice bucket. Klotz led all scorers with 20. Hun back with it, time winding down. Burnett to Ashley Ravelli. Three-point shot. It's good. Six-point game, just over one to play. But Lawrenceville held on. In fact, Riley went to the line and hit two shots. Big Red now go to Connecticut for the eight schools tournament. We played together as a team, and everybody did what they were supposed to. I mean, everyone was hitting the layups that they were supposed to be making. Julia and Kennedy were just under there. They weren't missing. They were making everything. Further north of there, Princeton's ladies playing host to the DePaul Blue Demons, who just lost to Tennessee in the Maggie Dixon Classic. Demons head coach Doug Bruno, though, thrilled about his team's 8-2 and two start, as Courtney Banghart is proud of her ladies winning seven of their first nine. DePaul with the ball early, Brittany Hrinko driving into the lane. She's fouled, but count the basket. Hrinko a 12-point performance on the night. Naveen Rashid, whose name rhymes with machine. Sometimes her offensive output making her seem like one. Here she nets two of her 23 points on the evening. That top to Paul's Keisha Hampton for the game high. And speaking of Hampton, here she is. Nothing but net on that. The lead switching hands a lot early. Lauren Polanski, no relation to Roman, dishing it to Lauren Edwards for three. Woo! Edwards, a 10-point scorer. When the Lady Tigers were on defense, though, they found it hard to handle Hampton. She got it done from all over the court, putting this up successfully. She was 9 for 15 from the floor. But Polanski and company not letting anything get out of hand in the first half. She puts this up. Takes a while to fall in, but does. That was Polanski's only basket, believe it or not. Megan Rogowski, 21 of the Blue Demons from the edge of the paint. That's good for her lone bucket. Polanski later from midcourt to Megan Bowen, who looks and finds Rashid wide open, and that's a deuce. Princeton's one one point lead just before the midpoint of the first half soon disappeared, though, as DePaul went on a 9 2 run, which featured Hampton banking this bucket. 23 17 Blue Demons, just over eight to go before the half. Princeton's Kristen Helmstetter to Edwards. She tries again from downtown, no good. Rebound Helmstetter. She takes a shot, still not in there. Devonna all good makes the third time, all good. The North Carolina native had a 14 point evening, but the Blue Demons, like Maureen Mulchrome with this three pointer, controlled the flow of the game the rest of the way. They led by 14 at the half, and they beat Princeton 78 67, dropping the Lady Tigers to 7 and 3 on the season. Just a reminder, those early your Hun Lawrenceville highlights brought to you by the same folks who bring us all of our high school highlights, the Hamilton Township Education Association, members working to ensure your child's future success. And finally, Team of the Day is brought to you by Prior NAMI Business Systems, an authorized Canon Sales and Service Center, your business solutions headquarters, Prior NAMI. They say misery loves company. Well, Hun's boys ice hockey team, like their girls basketball squad, also lost Tuesday. But moreover, the Princeton Day Panthers, who beat the Raiders on the ice, improved to 6-0 and on the year with the win. The final was 6-1, and it featured two goals from Panther star John Egner. PDS goalie Walker Ward tallied 13 team saves and Panther Ice Hockey is our prior NAMI team of the day. Well, that's all for sports. In a moment, regardless of how much snow we get this winter, fighting the cold is paramount. Find out how you can help those less fortunate keep warm on tonight's Mercer County Close-Up next.